So the art skills I have are very limited in visual, limited in that uh, I can do a Word document and that's about it. So limited to none. I did a, an illustration course many years ago, so my background is an artistic one, I suppose. I uh, haven't delved into it for some time, so I was really excited to come tonight, really excited. When I was young, of course, I painted and I did the drawing and stuff, so I've always liked it. But actually, this was interesting for me because I wanted to do an activity with my daughter. And hers is messy, just like her room. <laughs> Mine is neat. Our children are all primary school age. Yeah. So we've done primary school painting. Plenty of. No, I have no art background, no skills. So it's been a lot of fun to, to learn how to do this. I did a little bit of painting when I was in year 12, kind of high school, but not since. So it was really fun to try and get back into it. Yeah, I have painted before, but just once a watercolour. So this is the first time I've painted paint less water. <laughs> now, in keeping with this colour scheme behind me, I'm going to work with a light pink and then stop at some point and then swirling back on itself. So coming here tonight, I didn't have a lot of expectations, I guess, except hanging out with some mates, um, painting, and it doesn't really matter how it turns out. Encourage you to experiment and just have fun. Melbourne has so many things available to do, but if you don't want to do restaurants and you don't want to do sport, <laughs> like it's good to have places like this studio to give you another option. I learned that I enjoy it. Yeah. I think it's therapeutic. And we can paint and talk at the same time. <laughs> Uh, we met new people and we already knew one girl that was here, so it's it's very nice. Everyone is different backgrounds, different ages, so it's been very different. Right? Very good. Um, I didn't really have any ideas coming in to what I wanted to do with it. I just sort of let it come out. So what has come out is quite unexpected, but at the same time, I didn't really have any expectations to begin with. So it was just really fun to experiment and see what came out. Yeah. Yes, it was less stressful than I thought. The teacher was really helpful, so that was all good. Everyone's naturally got their, it's like handwriting, everyone naturally strokes in a different way. Got to laugh, got to sing, and yeah, just hang out with mates and have a good time. Come to Cork and Chroma. <laughs> have fun. It's really fun. I think it's really awesome to actually be here. It's actually really good. I didn't know what to expect. Give it a go. I just, I think it's well worth it, 100%. I would highly recommend to come, even if you don't know anything about art or painting. It's really fun. It's very, a very good thing to do with someone you like, a friend or something more. So I highly recommend. Yeah, like the vibe is here is just really great. Um, you know, drinks, having drinks and some laughter, you know, comparing each other's work, giving each other tips. Yeah, it's really good. Come to Cork and Cromer, it's great. I'm enjoying it a lot. We learnt lots. Um, probably to be more creative and breathe a little. And not everything is in paint by numbers. And also all the colours mixed together turn brown. <laughs>